bioremediation has the potential to degrade and remove pollutants from contaminated water sources using microorganisms. Bioleaching is a form of bioremediation strategy that enables heavy metal dissolution. Water. Safe and readily available water is important for public health, whether it is used for drinking, domestic use, food production, or recreational purposes. But the amount of fresh water on Earth is limited. The water quality around the world is under constant pressure due to climate change and pollution. Factors of water system pollution are the presence of pathogens, traces of toxic chemicals, and heavy metals. Due to the increasing development of industrial sectors across the world, threats to clean water sources are growing. Traces of heavy metal ions discharged into wastewater are a major threat. Some of the key heavy metal pollutants in industrial wastewater are mercury, copper, lead, arsenic, and cadmium. Trace amounts of non-essential heavy metals found in water systems are a hazard. 80% of wastewater is discharged into the environment without adequate treatment. It could potentially be a sustainable resource when microalgae remediation is applied. Microalgae are capable of thriving in the harsh conditions of the AMD. They have the ability to maintain neutral pH values and adaptation to store heavy metals in their vacuole or chloroplasts. Bioleaching is method and algae specific. A species of red algae is able to uptake cadmium ions while a species of green algae can degrade copper, zinc, cadmium and lead. This is the recovery process of heavy metal ions that showcase the reusability of microalgae after it has been separated from the metal ions. Advantages include complete utility of both living and dead biomass, enhancement of heavy metal binding efficiency, application in secondary and tertiary wastewater treatment, and reusability of microalgae after separation of metal concentrated cells. In conclusion, application of microalgae in bioleaching is an efficient and effective alternative. It has a wide range of potential for bioleaching of various types of heavy metals. And lastly, this approach allows for nations to strive towards the Sustainable Development Goals.